Hello, how are you doing? I'm doing great. How are you? I'm fine. Thank you for asking. So it's our first meeting. So let's introduce ourselves. Okay. Firstly, I will introduce. After that, you can introduce. My name is Vishal Duhanne. Basically, I am from Sonipat, Haryana. But I live in Panchkula city. If I talk about my educational qualification, I studied graduation. Right now, I am a working person. I do my job in railway sector. It's a government job. Nowadays, I am learning this language. Okay, so I'll introduce myself. So my name is Arna Shukla. I'm eight years old. I'm studying class fourth. I study in a public school. I live in Madhya Pradesh, Bhopal. I want to ask about my hobbies. I love to learn new languages, dancing, singing, praying to God, playing basketball, and lots of other things. This is all about me. Okay, what is your mother tongue? My mother tongue is Hindi. Okay, how many languages do you speak? Well, I speak English and Spanish and French and Korean and Chinese. I'm still learning them, but I can speak okay. this a little. Okay, okay. In your school, in which medium are you studying? I'm studying in an English medium school. Okay, and in your home, Apart from you, how many persons are there who speak English? Okay, so in my family, there's six members. Me, my younger brother, and my parents can speak English, but not my grandparents. Okay. And for improving your level, which activity do you do? To improve my level? Yes, in English language. Can you please repeat? I didn't get it. Okay. For, for you are improving your communication skills or make a good command in this language, what do you do apart from YouTube? Well, I try to ask open-ended questions, which I can't... Open-ended questions are the questions that that people can't reply yes or no to. They have to say more than that. And I've also learned to that even if it was a close question, you can add something to the answer to make it open. It's a good response to keep your conversation going. It can also help to improve your conversation skills. Okay, you mentioned that you are living in Bhopal city. It's capital of Madhya Pradesh. Yes. Okay. Which thing do you like in your city and which thing you don't like in your city? Well, I like everything in my city because Bhopal is a very beautiful natural city. It is covered with lakes and mountains. And its education policy, yes, it is really good because it is covered. It has lots of universities and colleges. And its famous food is Dabhat. Yeah, yeah and then... And if it's for that, yeah, there's one thing bad happened in Bhopal. I'll tell you about it. Like in Bhopal, in the year called 1982. 1918-14, I think in month of December, there was a tragedy happened in due to a gas like a missile isocyanide, I think, regarding something. Yeah. Yes, I actually know the disaster. I know the air a little bit. It starts with 19 and then... Yes, it's a long time ago. Yes. But every day we see many accidents happen in society, in everywhere, not only in Bhopal. Yes. Which food is your favorite food? Okay, so I'll tell you about my favorite foods. My favorite healthy foods are pulao, fried rice and poha, and my favorite junk foods are samosa, chong, me and mani. Okay. Are you enjoying okay. your day? 
Hi, you can see me that today Sunday is your hectic. You have a hectic schedule. Ba, what? Are you enjoying your weekend? Yes, I am enjoying it a lot. Okay. If you have chance to go anywhere in world for study purpose, so where do you want to go and why? Outside India. Outside India. Oh, you're asking where I want, where I want to go for next trip. Yes. Okay, so I'll tell the countries where I want to go. I'm thinking of going to Nepal and to the UK. Okay. <laughs> okay. I watch your some videos and I found that some persons know you from your dance videos. Where do you upload your dance video? I upload my dance videos in my YouTube channel. Okay. Okay, ask okay. me anything. Ask me anything. Okay, so tell me more about your profession. Okay, I work in railway sector and my responsibility here, I work here as a technician. So uh, we prepare new train coaches. So we okay. work on ground level. Ah, and apart from good. job, railway provide us many allowances like water facility for living, free traveling in trains. So they provide us many facilities. So I am happy there. And the environment is very friendly there. All person are very supportive. And main thing I am blessed that I am posted in my home state. I live in Panskula city. It's very close to Chandigarh city. And both cities are very neat and clean. Environment is very good there. Air quality, water quality, all things are top notch there. And there are health facility, education facility, all are in good condition. And it's a hill station. Oh, oh, sounds good. Yes. So tell me like what do you where... think about Haryana? Okay, what do you think about Haryana? I yes, I really like to Haryana. I have visited lots of places in Haryana when I was a little. Okay, you don't remember the memories. Okay, what does your father do? My father is a pharmacist. Okay. And Just even my mother, she's a nursing officer. Okay, both are in medical line. And what is your goal in your life? What do you want to become? I want to become an IFS of the UK. Or maybe a botanist because I love plants. I just can't choose from both of them because I love them both. Okay, best of luck for your future. I hope all your dream come true very soon. Yes, I think so. Yes. Okay, so can you please tell me about your state? Okay. I live in Haryana state. It's uh, our capital is Chandigarh. Haryana and Punjab have same capital, Chandigarh. And uh, right now our here is BJP is ruling here. Our CM is Nayab Singh Saini. Former CM was Manohar Lal Khattar. And our population is uh, more than two crore. And in Haryana, some places are places are very famous. In Haryana, Gurugram is very developed. It's the IT hub of Haryana. And Kurukshetra is very famous because it's directly related with Mahabharata. And in Panipat is famous for their battles. In future, whenever you, you will start studying history subject, you will notice that Panipat's battle one, Paris battle two. So it's a part of Haryana. And Haryana is doing extremely well in sports. You found a sport person in every sports, people come from Haryana. Some cricketer from Haryana, some, uh, some in football, they are belong to Haryana. 
and uh, major, many persons they are playing wrestling kabaddi so they also in haryana and kalpana chawla she also belong to haryana she worked with nasa okay anything else you, if you want to ask me regarding my state you can ask जी जानवी पवार डू नो जानवी पवार ये ओके आई फॉरगेट और जानवी पवार यस शी आल्सो बिलोंग टू हरियाणा यस शी आल्सो फ्रॉम हरियाणा ओह शी इज वेरी गुड इन दिस लैंग्वेज एंड आई थिंक शी स्पीक इन मेनी एक्सेंट लाइक यू यस शी इज आई रियली लाइक हर Yes, she speaks very well. Oh, okay. So tell me, what is your mother tongue and what language you use at home? Okay, our mother tongue is Haryanvi. So in my home, usually we speak in Haryanvi only. And oh, in my so... job place, I use Hindi language. Oh, so can you teach me some Haryanvi? <laughs> okay in haryan we in starting we don't use good morning good day good night good afternoon this type of greetings we don't use we we use ram ram bhai so after that we ask other person ke haal se oh and how to say hello in that language hello it's a haryanvi same oh uh. but we do namaste we prefer namaste or ram ram we don't say hello oh uh. but in phone in in virtual mode we use hello otherwise not oh now i get it yes and nowadays haryanvi songs are all also popular they are getting popular today by day some haryanvi songs they are gain they gained more than billion views on youtube some are very famous okay so can okay so can you be sing me one haryanvi song no but i recommend you some song you can search bhavan gajga damand this song is quite popular oh really okay i'll search it Yes, it's quite popular. Okay, so do you have any other question for me? Okay, when did you start your channel? Okay, so to ask the tell about my journey. Well, when I was three years old, when I was in pre-nursery and nursery, I sang a poem. A cow passed us. It is a Hindi poem. I sang it in Hindi and in the British accent at the same time because he used to speak Hindi like this. Now my principal noticed that. So in the PTM, she asked my parents, "Do you speak in a British accent with your child?" When she sang the poem, she sang it in Hindi and with that accent. My parents became so happy. They started to teach me English. and the saxon although they don't know english at all they're from a hindi medium school so they watch english videos make notes and teach me and they don't let me speak in english until i become six when i became six years old my parents were in a big tension now how can we teach our child hindi what if we have to give her admission in hindi coaching so they taught me in hindi and english and this is the end of my journey okay and the last question what is your advice for children like they are four year old five years old and what is your advice for children and their parents okay so i like was some motivation for them to learn english for five years old children okay okay so okay. sir But children don't be really scared. This English is just a language. What's the problem if you don't know English? I'll give you some recommendations. If you want to learn English and if you want to improve your vocabulary, 
We always listen to English speakers, watch YouTube videos, read English newspapers and books, and listen to speakers. Our, and to improve the vocabulary, read the English newspapers while, while there are many, many word words in the world. But in newspaper, only normal words come. But if you see a word that you have never heard of it before, put, underline it, and, and, type, and search it in Google. And you'll see the meaning. And that's how you can improve your vocabulary and your English speaking. Okay, Peter. Thank you so much. You explained very well. You're welcome. Okay, it was great talking to you. And nice to meet you. We will meet again and again. Definitely. Okay, so shall we wrap up the session now? I will do another one. Then when I will be free. Okay. Thank you again. Okay, bye. Have a nice day. Bye. Bye-bye.